Okay, Troy, this is God of Wonder, and, and what a cool thing. This is the capo right here on the third fret, and this allows us to play all the same chords we know, but now they're up they're higher notes, and that's so it's a different different sound. It's it's higher up pitches. So the first part is the verse. Uh, it's just gonna be a, a minor, and for each each beat, one, we're gonna go down, up, down, up for every beat. So it's gonna be three, three beats on A minor, beat number four is that one finger G over B, which, which we're just gonna play just the B right there because the rest of the strings make a G chord. And then we're gonna play a C chord for four counts. So it's one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Now remember for each one of those beats, we're gonna go down, up, down, up with the pick. So we're gonna go one, two, three, four, That's all it is. The chorus goes G, D, A minor, C, uh, four beats of each, and a down, up, down, up for each beat. So one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. When it gets to the end of the chorus, after doing that two times, it stays on the C for two measures right there. And now we're at the second verse, and the second verse, instead of going A minor to this G with the B down here, and then C, it starts with a D chord. So it's D, two, three, then same thing, one, two, three, four. So practice those three parts, and you'll find that without the capo, it's going to be the same thing, you know? Just try those three sections on their own, and we'll put them together next week, and, and hopefully jam along with the song with the capo and everything. Sounds good, good man. Good, good song. It'll be fun. Thanks.